Hey my people, what's going on? This is Major Major TV. Let's talk. I want to talk about a comment that somebody made a while ago. And um, I just seen him today. I don't want to um, call him out or what have you, but I told him to use his, his, comment, his quote. And the quote was, leadership is in the mirror. And I really want to talk about that because there's grave concern about Grandmaster J and MFAC and what we should do as blacks. But let me first start by reading what is leadership. Leadership is the art of motivating a group of people to act toward achieving a common goal. Again, leadership is the art of motivating a group of people to act toward achieving a common goal. It's simple, y'all. When you wake up every day, and you get the kids and family organized and you go to work while they go to school and when that day is completed and you all make it home safely at the end of the day that's leadership you really put together common goals for the family to achieve the kids go to school, do a great job. You go to work or go to your business and do a spectacular job and then come back home. The kids become a little smaller and you have gained some more money in your pocket. But it was a goal that got you there. So stop believing that there's some leadership that can just lead you throughout the course of your life. One thing I learned about being attached to people, I learned the hard way. Some God, sometimes God takes people out your life just like he put them in your life. And sometimes things just happen. But in Grandmaster J case, and in fact, I don't believe by 40 out of our life forever. But what I'm trying to say is, he instructed us through the monumental and factual feelings what we should do as black people. How we need to clean up our community. How we become, should become culturally aware. How we should focus on this systemic racism, police violence, marginalizing, excluding and suppression of blacks. It's not hard, people. Change would never happen to a people until they change in addition demand justice. And you can demand justice all kind of ways. We have to be on all fronts. Like I said, I'm not with this group or that group. I'm with any black group or organization or individual that's about helping black people. To be a good leader, you have to be a good follower. So that means you have to listen, pay attention, and then follow instructions. In the army, right, a military. You have the generals and subordinates and other, right? That all is leads in their own right, whether it's general, colonel, major, captain, lieutenant, sergeant, um, etc., right? Down to the soldier, right? They lead in their own way, but they have leadership. They have the ultimate say, right? And we know... The government, you know, the president, what have you, you know, have the final say. But everybody is just a domino effect of what needs to be done. And when you give an instruction, like you tell your kids, when they go to school, do this, that, and other, right? You tell your husband or you tell your wife, this one needs to be done, right? And... When that goal is achieved, you have organized a group of people, a person to come behind a goal, a common goal to achieve. We do it every day in our lives. Grandmaster J, in fact, have gave us instructions and shows that we can legally be on the Second Amendment, establish a militia, 
and go to protesters do formations go learn how to fire your weapon or learn the ramifications of organization and structure logistics etc when dealing with black militia and I can go on with this but he talked about a host of things right and he also reminded us that our situation is the same and those who lead at the top have been around a while is the same because they wasn't ready to do what take the extra step so now it's time for us to take the extra step I will call and give me anything you don't have to necessarily be a black militia it could be starting black businesses in the black community starting a whole initiative for that right it can be a situation where it's starting black schools you know more of an Afrocentric way of perceiving thing right or, or start some kind of black spirituality, right? The rule was from all the religions that control us. There can be a movement dealing with the fact of police in our community, right? It can deal with a movement dealing with we need more, not more, we need black hospitals. We need more black banks. All these can be different initiatives, right? We need more black men in black boys lives we need more black women in black girl lives there's so many moving in fronts and there's people already out here doing it right we might don't hear about it but they're doing it so again i was encouraged to thank this brother um that um wrote this comment leadership is in the mirror so whenever you get up and you go face yourself to do your personals and whatnot, brush your teeth, wash your face, or, or groom yourself up or whatever, you look cute, look handsome, what have you. Remember, leadership is in the mirror. This is Major with Major TV. For new, um, anyone new, subscribe, hit the notification button. Y'all like and share. Thank you for listening. Thank you for all the support. They'll continue to stay black. They'll continue to stay on cold and stay focused. Peace.